Josh Shapiro versus Doug Mastriano was one of the starkest. Yep. Yeah. Well, I mean, I will say the Wisconsin races, the, both yes. the governor's race and the yeah. Senate race in Wisconsin are very, very stark contrast between those candidates. But the Pennsylvania governor's race with Doug Mastriano and Josh Shapiro, it was harder to get two candidates who offered different, different visions for the state that were more different than the two. It, it was and, the governor's race and the secretary of state's race because the governor appoints the, the secretary, secretary of state. state. And yeah. what was going to happen in Pennsylvania uh, with Mastriano was one of those issues that, that one of those possibilities that made Joe Biden say democracy is on the ballot. And Pennsylvania Shapiro, could have lost democracy. Shapiro ran on extremism and abortion, yeah. and he tied it all together in one of the most powerful speeches of the midterm Saturday night in Philadelphia um, in, a, in that, that big event with President Biden and President Obama. But he ran on abortion. He, he also was the target of anti-Semitic attacks yeah. on a mm -hmm. daily basis. Mastriano yep. took money from Gab. I mean, it was sort of the center of the extremist MAGA movement running against a very competent, very message disciplined, very, very good candidate in Josh Shapiro. And by the way, Josh Shapiro, for two, two things. One thing is his margin. If his margin stays looking like that, yes, this yeah. is not a state where you're necessarily going to see people ticket split. There isn't. You can kind of see where there might be a, you know, uh, somebody who would vote for the governor of Georgia, the sitting governor of Georgia, but also vote for Warnock. It's hard to imagine a ticket splitting voter in Pennsylvania. The other thing is that in Philadelphia, one of the things that campaigns that, that, that they were concerned about was, can they get the under 25 vote out? Young voters are actually turning out in higher numbers than Democrats actually ex even expected them to. Mm. Josh Shapiro made a big play for younger voters in Philadelphia, for voters of color in Philadelphia who were targeted. And, and those issues, abortion was a huge issue for voters under 25. And so if he maintains that kind of margin, it might be a big enough margin to pull Fetterman over the top. Well, Let's...